Scorpions, welcome to Brutally True Tarot and this reading is from 10th of July to 16th of July. So let's check what are the messages for you. Prince of Knives. Sun, Ten of Scepters, Prince of Scepters. Two of sectors. Okay, so someone is trying hard to show you that um, they don't care. In fact, uh, with this Prince of Sectors, this person might be flirting around like they have got a lot, lot of options, a thousand options, and um, they can replace you easily. That's that's what they think, and. Um, they feel that they can actually make you think that. They feel that they can make you think uh, that you are replaceable. And um, seems like um, with the ten of sectors, they don't know how to get rid of their feelings. So not only this person is struggling with the ten of sectors, they have got a lot of burden feels like this person is feeling guilty, they are feeling helpless, they are feeling lost without you. But definitely this person has got uh, no courage to accept that. Because this, this is someone with a huge ego and um, they cannot accept that they are actually empty without you. They feel that they cannot approach someone because they have this image of Prince of Scepters. This could be someone who has got a charming personality, especially when it comes to looks. This person can be, you know, gifted in that department. Also, this person seems to be really, you know, charming. When they talk, uh, people listen like, um, like nothing else matters. So this person feels that um, that is going to work once again and uh, they can make you believe whatever they want you to believe. And uh, now with this Prince of Knives, this person feels that um, they just cannot uh, enjoy this feeling. Here you see the sun, they want to embrace you, they want to love you, they want to hold you close. This person knows that you are the one. This person knows that without you, they cannot find their Home. They cannot find a place where they feel comfortable and complete. This person knows that your arms are the ultimate uh, pleasure for them. And uh, this person is going desperate now. With the Prince of Knives, this person is feeling that um, something has been withdrawn or something has been taken away that was... Uh, you know really important and now this prince of knives is dealing with the pain they have this rose they know that uh, you are this rose but uh, they also have this idea that you can uh, show your other side too if they provoke you to i mean uh, it's about uh, getting triggered this person knows that they are triggering you by their acts and uh, you know how to deal and deal with such situation. You have got um, the courage to, 
you know, walk away. Probably this person had no idea that you two have this courage. And uh, with this two of scepters, this person feels stuck. Also two of scepters is about some kind of suffering or health issue. Probably this person is not in the right frame of mind and uh, they feel that things are falling apart, not getting any response from you or not feeling complete. It's driving them crazy. This person is feeling um, depressed nowadays. Though of course, this is a general reading. This may not resonate with everyone. The energy could be reversed as well. Also, you can check your moon and rising sign. Let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. of scepters in reverse the moon nine of skulls and ace of grace so ace of scepters is in reverse this person felt that they will enjoy their life without you I mean this could be someone who was constantly telling you that you were taking away their space their freedom and uh, now they feel that um, whatever they had with you was a blessing this person is now realizing that they are responsible for losing this blessing and uh, you know that freedom has turned into loneliness and this person just cannot find a way out of this loneliness with the moon they are hurt they feel directionless and they don't know what to say it's something that they asked for and they were granted by the universe or you know they chose this for themselves and now they are stuck they are hurt who will they blame what will they do next they don't know and that is the problem here with this nine of skulls a lot of things are falling in line for you a lot of things will show up in the physical reality i mean the things you were wishing for um, are actually coming your way with this ace of grails it's about a complete world no matter whether this person approaches you or not you can see it clearly in this week the universe will show you clearly that they are interested in fact their body language will reveal a lot with this high priestess this person thinks that uh, you are mysterious this person feels that they cannot understand you or you are not ready to share your secrets with them you are not ready to give them what they thought is theirs once i mean they felt that they had rights over you but now this person knows that no you have set your boundaries and uh, you are not going to give them uh, something that they don't deserve let's check an oracle message for you Seduction. Fear the roaring flames with the masterful trance that calls upon heaving chest. Give in to its alluring grip, if you please, but heed my warning of the claws that draw blood without mercy. So there is this seduction. With the card of sun, definitely there is this connection that cannot be denied. There is fire, there is love, there is this depth. But at the same time, it's um, something that you need to um, pay attention to. Can you deal with uh, this kind of person again and again? I'm not saying that this person is bad, but it's about maturity. 
maybe they're not enough mature at this point and um, they still need to do a lot of things to deserve you so that is what Tara is telling you make sure that this person deserves you before you make any decision so this was the reading for this week i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching till next video bye